out of YouTube. So, I'm going to show you a test. You got to use a scan tool. Uh, and it'll help you see if your vehicle is ready for your state emissions test. Now, this does not guarantee you anything. It could also fail if all even though all these are lit up and working. So, yeah, I'm just going to show you it's a basic test that'll show you if your monitors are set. So, plug in your scan tool, hit vehicle diagnostics. And my vehicle's already on there, but we're going to pretend like it's not. Auto ID Turn key off for 10 seconds and turn key on. Key is off. Turn key on. Enter. Got that cable. Mine has different cables. It has like a, some OBD1 stuff and whatnot. So it's, it's interchangeable cable. So that's all it's saying. Communicating with the vehicle. That's it, 04 Blazer. Yes. Communicating. Yes. So, right there, not all supported IM monitor tests are complete. So, right that right there already tells me that it's not ready for. Huh. Got code. Okay, so once we go through that stuff, you can look at your special functions, global two, global OBD2 functions, IM monitors. So right here are your monitors. So misfire is okay, fuel system's okay, and uh So if you look over here, INC, NA, INC, NA, NA, INC. So anything with NA, like those three, uh, this vehicle does not have. But anything saying INC, that's inconclusive. Those need to be set before you can get your emissions done. Because this is basically, all emissions tests anymore is... Plugged in through the OBD2. I don't know exactly how it works, but there's no on these newer vehicles no tailpipe testers. So yeah, so all these have to be set, and there can't be any check engine lights as well, like for a misfire or a fuel cap or whatever. Check engine light needs to be off. Service engine light needs to be off, uh, and all these monitors need to be set. So. How do you set these? There's different drive cycles for your vehicle. Uh, and that's how these set. Now, what what makes them cleared is if you had a check engine light and you cleared the computer, those will clear your uh, monitors. Also, like in my case, the battery died. So, it could clear it sometimes very quickly, other times not so much. This one sat for a while, so that's why, because I haven't gotten around to it, that's why they're not set. So, to set them, there's different driving cycles and, you know, on-off cycles and heating and cooling cycles some of these cars need to go through. And uh, they, they're different. But uh, basically, just drive it around a good bit and keep plug in your scan twin every now and then and uh, checking them. Once they're all set you'll be able to go see about a state emissions test. So that's all for this one. Thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more. So until next time, stay crazy. Have a good one people.